Carson Scheidler was 19 yeah. and had a stroke. Yeah, I, I even thought the same. I was like, it's not, I've never heard of that before, but I guess it happens. It happened nearly a year ago while in his dorm at IU Bloomington. On March 5th, he lost use of his arm. Then his speech, his head, he said, was pounding. I was just locked in my body. His twin brother came to check on him and immediately called for help. They said I had a stroke and I was just so confused. Hours later, he was airlifted from Bloomington to Ascension St. Vincent, where he underwent surgery. The area of brain that was at risk was, was huge and it would have left him devastated had we not been able to do anything. Recovery took months after the small stroke. <sighs> It took several weeks before Scheidler could speak coherent sentences, and that's when he and his family noticed he developed an accent. This video is from so, June. And a lot of people say Taylor, German or Russian, um, but it has improved greatly. The complication is called foreign accent syndrome. This is the first case I've ever seen, for sure. You know, there are only about 100 cases worldwide that have been reported. It's still unclear why Scheidler developed this accent, but it went away after four to five months. I knew what an American accent sounded like, obviously, and I tried to say my words in the American accent, but they just want to come out that way. The takeaway from this college student's story, know the signs of a stroke. Just know to get help, even if even if it's nothing, get help because it can change your life. Fast, face drooping, arm weakness, speech difficulties, and time. The, the real hero in this story is his brother who recognized this. We all can can be the hero and, and make that call. Working for you, Nikki Dementry, WRTV.